Welcome to Back to the Dawn. Just a demo, but it's an interesting RPG. Like, just let me name off the uh, like. Just let me explain uh, what they say on the Steam Store page. An exciting RPG set in a maximum security prison, populated by animals of every shape and size. Survive, explore, and escape. Along the way, you'll interact with a uh, motley crew with a motley crew of interesting and unique characters. Be strong and be smart. It's not yourself you're saving, it's the whole city. So it looks like some kind of like a prison simulator with furries, with RPG elements, and also if I, so they say on the store page, hardcore story. Uh, let's see, the story is because of a factual, because of factual news, Thomas, a righteous journalist, was framed and jailed. 21 days later, there'll be two paths in front of him. Escape or despair. He must mediate in various ways in prison, collect evidence, investigate the truth, and wait for vindication. Uh, fully integrate into the vast prison. Play it by the rules and face the harsh environment. Survive and escape. To be a model prisoner and live in peace or a troublemaker that will wreak havoc. It's all up to you. Like, come on, how does that not sound exciting? Because I honestly, personally, I wasn't too big on prison simulator for one thing. But this, with RPG elements, I do believe there's like you can work out to build strength or things like that. I could be completely wrong, but just by like the, the images and everything else. It's just like, play your own kind of game. I'm excited. I want to see maybe what I can do in the demo, but we'll we'll try uh, just to go with the flow. I'm just not sure if I should play with the controller or not. Let me check the options. Never mind, there's not much. Let's just start the game then. Hopefully playing with the... Ah, uh... oh, I can play two characters. Whoa, Fox Thomas is kind of weak. We could play as Black Panther. Not captured. Ooh, now I'm kind of curious. So I'm guessing it's like Thomas the Journalist. Does it... Maybe Dick's blob and uncovered detective poses as a criminal and infiltrates the prison for a top secret mission. Is it. I mean, this is like clearly easy mode, but. Is, is there any. I'm not yet. Ex, I'm not ready yet. Experience Thomas. Thomas's Fox's story first. Oh! Story, different stories. That's cool too. Okay. What? Okay, let's see. After graduating from college, you joined a television station as an intern and soon found your way in front of the camera thanks to your good looks. He's a fox, haha. <laughs> uh, you were able to get first-hand stories from the mouths of even the most reluctant interviewees. However, you, your years of working in the public eye has also made you extremely self-conscious about your image. Positive abilities. When performing chat options, have stamina consumption and charisma plus one. Uh, negative effects, though. If you don't take a shower, my negative one when you wake up the next day. So shower every day. Got it. Uh, jail smarts, though. We got plus one. Uh, increases the r report gained when trading with prisoners. Okay, so we're good at negotiating, too. Wait. Oh, so we can change... Yeah, okay, select my experience. Agility. We can also do the... We can do the three, basically. Hmm. As a journalist, you all know all too well that the city's evils are often hidden in the darkest corners. That is why you always carry a miniature camera when you adventure into seedy back streets on your quest to reveal the truth. However, the constant danger has made you overly cautious. Adds two extra pocket slots and max violation of carried items plus 20. That sounds useful. I can craft tools and weapons. When making a challenge with success rate of less than 30, you can't re-roll. During the Civil War in the Republic of Vaslovia five years ago, or Slavia, you volunteered to go to the front lines as a war correspondent. You photographed up close the struggle that civilians endured during the fighting. Life on the battlefield left you physically strong, but the horrors of war are forever scarred in your mind, or seared in your mind. Extends uh, satiety, 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 satiety. Man, it's another word I haven't pronounced for a while. Satiety. Satiety. All right, satiety it is. Uh, negative effects. Nightmares can't be automatically forgiven, or can't be automatically forgotten. Nightmares, huh? The duration of medicine effects is extended by one hour. Um, agility, though. And you can craft simple weapons. Intelligence. Mmm, you know, I'd like the extra pockets, probably. That sounds more like my style. If it's the law of the jungle in this city, then how are we any different from wild animals? It's like the Zootopia questions. No, but I don't know how many episodes I could even do on just with this demo alone. I'm, I'm, I feel like I might get overwhelmed. Dear viewers, I'm here at Lame Leg River near the Black Marsh Chemical Plant in Skid Road. As you can see, the river is purple. It also has a very pungent odor. Yeah. Mm. 
Uh, I'm with one of the residents of the riverbank. Let's hear his thoughts on the matter. My thoughts, this damn chemical plant opened less than two years ago and it's already devastated the surrounding area. Those heartless sons of bitches must have dumped sewage into the river at night. Now all the fish are dead. Just smell the stench. So many kids are sick. They, they can't stop coughing and have rashes all over the bodies. It's messed up. And have you informed the authorities, such as the Environmental Protection Agency or City Hall? Of course, but they're useless. None of them want to take responsibility. I heard that the mayor's nephew has shares in the plant. The bastards are all in it together. Hmm. So I was digging too deep in this story, huh? They see us poor people in Skid Road is less than nothing. Viewers, is the tragic situation here the result of illegal sewage dumping? And is the inaction of the authorities due to the mayor's involvement? We'll continue to investigate the story, so stay tuned for our follow-up report. I'm Thomas the Fox, Woodpecker TV, reporting live from... Excellent interview, your reputation is well deserved. I'm sure you didn't ask me here just to watch a video with you, Mr. Campaign Manager. Indeed not, we're both busy men, I'll get straight to the point. As you know, the mayor's four-year term is almost up, the election is just around the corner. He's seeking re-election, has hired me, Angelo, as his campaign manager. The mayor asked the Eraser for help, he must be desperate. The eraser? Oh, that's just baseless slander. I'm a serious social activist. But let's... I can't take anyone who calls themselves an activist seriously, but... Let's just go on. Well, let's get back to the point. Cards on the table. The mayor does indeed have a certain relative who holds shares in a plant. But the mayor wasn't aware of the fact, and no, no so-called power for money deal ever took place. But your interview may cause some more unsophisticated citizens to misunderstand the situation. So hope you'll reconsider your follow-up report. Oh, I get's going on. It's the, it's the, hey, you better accept our deal if you wanna not find yourself in a body bag tomorrow, you should get rid of your article, buddy. Totally. It's like what Hillary Clinton does, basically, before you get two shots in the back of the head suicide, you know? <laughs> uh, oh, none of these options makes me avoid the Hillary Clinton scenario. Oh, no. Uh, I'll just go with what I'm doing. I, I, got, I get this guy a mile away. What a great journalist. I admire your passion for your work. But there's more to life than work. Far more. What are you trying to say? A little birdie told me you're still renting some flea bag apartment and broke up with your girl not too long ago. And no friends to speak of other than that lawyer you used to go to school with. Your aggressive reporting always gets you in trouble. He's the one who has to clean up your mess. <laughs> You've clearly done your research of me. You flatter me, but I'm just trying to make a point. We both find ourselves in situations that are less than ideal. We can help each other. Mm -hmm. Knuckles, the briefcase. I just even got a fancy gorilla with a briefcase. Ah, uh, except the Clinton money, basically. But in this world, it's the mayor's money. What's this? Are you trying to buy me? You got me wrong. I simply want you to join our camp... <laughs> join our campaign staff as head of the publicity. This is your fee. <laughs> if the fox was really smart, he'd see this as a silencing fee so we don't assassinate you fee. Someone of your talent, working as a TV reporter. Such a waste. I want to give you an opportunity, so will you join us or carry on with their thankless reporting? You're smart, Fox. I'm sure you'll make the right choice. Just, I mean, that's the problem. If they do get, try to give you money, that's blackmail. They'll, they'll have blackmail material. You could have like one of the people being undercover feds, and then they'll just say, Hey, I was an undercover fed, and this guy took the bribe money, and just plant drugs on you. They'll do anything. They will frame you. If you decline, you die. If you take the money, they have blackmail on you, so you better be a good little bitch, basically. Um, no matter what, I'll probably lose the money. So, I mean, I'm smart. I take the money and be like, Oh, I gotcha. I don't want to die after all. <laughs> Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Not that there's a threat to my life or anything. <laughs> I can join you, but my fee is double. No, 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 no. You have got yourself it. Oh, okay. I, I... I guess I just won't be having the money, so it doesn't matter how much. There'll always be an unfortunate people in this world. It's either us or them. Don't forget we're animals. Love jungle is second nature to us. Don't try to deny it. Well, then, a toast to the fruitful collaboration. Uh... To the mayor's re-election! Maybe too blunt. Maybe too blunt. The city's gonna turn to shit. 
The mayor will surely be reelected and continue his reign of corruption. I'm doing this the safe way. As the people of Skid Road, they'll be powerless to do anything about it. I'm just a lone reporter, man. But none of that concerns you, as your story has ended here. I took the Hillary Clinton money. Exactly. I knew what was happening. Thank you for playing the beta version. I literally beat the game already. Uh, continue. Right at the choice, maybe? Maybe we can try, like, manually save- oh. Okay, I'll just skip ahead then. I'll have to do the stupid thing of- I wonder if we can get assassinated, or just we play dumb and instead get the prison sentence? If we accept the money, it shouldn't be assassination. I'll, uh, I'll just maybe take the money, but then basically betray them and then, you know, get thrown under the bus. Because if we take the money, maybe they'd think to not assassinate, but use that as a means of framing to throw me in prison. Depends on how much they want to kill you, really. Alright, so I'm going to say I'll find out the truth. But... He's still going to say the same thing. But we can't accept the money, unfortunately. As fancy as it all is... Alright, let's see. Uh, I had to just decline. Put your money away, I'm not for sale. Oh, how unfortunate. Since you're so determined to be so stubborn, you leave me with no other choice. Is the eraser about to show his true colors? You can't buy me, so you have to resort to threats. Are you looking for the chance to erase me as well? If I mean, if that wasn't already, you know, considered as soon as I said no. No way, you're the hotshot who broke the contamination story. Uh, if you were to disappear, it would be a major headache for me. After all, the public do love to engage in wild speculation. I'm uh, glad to hear that. It, <laughs> I'm glad, glad to hear that. If there's nothing else, I'm, I'll be going. And I promise you'll see a follow-up report real soon. Man, take care, have a nice day. Uh, man, yeah, making f enemies of... He'll regret your food. Yeah. The fox is not smarter. The fox's intelligence is indeed... Not as high as the Black Panther from the uh, character selection. Mm, three cops already? I'm Sergeant Norman. This is my precinct. Is this your car? Uh, is there a problem? We used to have an anonymous tip that the car contains illegal substance. What'd I tell you? Plants. Uh, we're here to check. Hmm. Kyle, check up front. Eric, move your ass. Turn the trunk inside out. Sir, must, there must be some mistake. That's for us to detail the German. And then they'll find something, but I mean, honestly, if you just say, why is there no fingerprints on it, then, you know. I found it. He ha was hiding something, and it looks like grade A stuff. Uh, I mean, both of these answers probably do nothing. Yeah. He doesn't have any smart choices. What a great day. This calls for another drink. Yep. Uh, Thomas the Fox, prominent reporter for Woodpecker TV, was sentenced to three years in prison for a fine for $50,000 of possession of illegal substances. He will serve the sentence of Boulderton Prison. Sources stated he also suspected of bribing interviewees and fabric fabricating fake news stories. Among other violations, in the words of one of the city residents, I'm very disappointed in him. I no longer believe in any of his past reports. The investigation in the contamination of Lame Lake River has finally brought truth uh, the truth to light. The investigation team jointly formed by the City Hall Environmental Protection Agency issued a statement which read, The incident which was caused by a temporary worker who was drunk on the job. Yeah, it's just sort of, it becomes, this is really, really honest to, like, American politics and American corruption. And this is just, the, it's just too long, don't read, bottom left is saying, uh, it's like, FBI has investigated the FBI, and the FBI have found that there's no corruption within the FBI, is basically what's happened. Basically. Well, not the FBI. The mayor has investigated the mayor. 21 days until the mayor. Yeah, so we gotta try to get ourselves, uh, I guess, proven innocent, and make it so the mayor doesn't get reelected, and maybe get some revenge along the way, and, uh, I don't know, maybe... Maybe, I don't know, make some good friends. Stay on attention. Listen, good fish. From now on, you are inmate 1220. I'm Captain Bruce, and my words are the law you will obey. Do you understand? Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm gonna be a respectable... I, I, I'm, I'm gonna, like, I'm gonna play as I would if I were in prison and I were this fox. So, I understand. I'm not gonna be, like... I'm not gonna be a little prison bitch, and I'm going to play intelligently. 
click on the ground, not W. Oh, I can do WSD too. Let's be quick. I don't want to piss him off. Here it is, fish your new home. Before you go in, one last thing. Headcount is the new. Uh, headcount is in the lobby at zero uh, at eight a.m. You better not be late. Lobby. I get out of my sight. Who my roomie's with? Donkey. Ooh, a few. That guy talks a lot. But now is not the time to waste energy getting mad at him. It's been a week since my conviction, and I still haven't met with Reed, the lawyer. I don't know how the appeal is progressing. I need to contact him ASAP. Hmm. Ask the prisoners. They should know how to contact the outside. Oh, man, there's so much information. And also, does time go manually or, like, over if I doing things, I wonder? I wonder. I woke up too more early this morning. Let's see what we can do here. Let's see. A toilet sink combo. It looks quite advanced. I hope the water doesn't overflow from the sink when the toilet's blocked. To tutorial tip? Wait, what? Your toilet sink combo doesn't look pretty, but it gets the job done. Use the toilet. What happens to food after you eat it? It gets digested, of course. Digestion will accumulate in your gut. Once it reaches 2, you can empty it any time by going to the toilet, but when it reaches 20, even the slightest fart could be dangerous. Oh my god. Um, so yeah, t time does go out. Head, ki head count, 745. I don't feel like anything. So where do I find my poop? Maybe if I find my stats? Body... If your body falls under, it triggers weak body. Okay. Agility constitution. Uh, current satiety... Negative one per hour. So that's... Converted into digestion. When digested, you're gonna use the toilet. Okay. So that's... I guess food. We could eat some food. And we got some money, we got a backpack, status, focus, uh, concentration. If you fail a challenge, you can spend focus points to re-roll. Focus points are capped at six. One point is accumulated every 60 minutes. So the next point is that. Survival of your body, da. Digestion, prestige. You can befriend gang members. Ooh. Unaffiliated, no gang. Equipment, one shoe, which creates reputation. Oh my. But having the spare pocket is going to help greatly, hell yeah. Coin. Dissembly tool can be used to dissemble... Ah, oh, so like a screwdriver maybe? Thing? Improvised item demo. Paper crane. You have no idea how it ended up in your pocket, but you have a vague feeling it would be an amazing gift. And three of them. Foo, too. Wait, like... How many po these little mini pockets? Like, interesting. It's food. I guess... How's my mind at now? I guess I could eat the chocolate bar. Um, because, oh, charisma, I don't want to eat that then. I wanted, uh, yeah. All right, so let's see, skills. Win three fights. Oh man, so I gotta beat the shit out of people? The most important thing to remember when using a weapon, stab with a pointy end and increases the points provided by weapons when fighting. Stay tuned. Complete 50 bench presses during your workout. Hell yeah. Win three fights. Wisdom. Wisdom tree, creativity, f there's a lot. Wait, activate skill. Well, things we do will give us intelligence in certain parts, okay. Fine enough. We us just like, try to find things. There seems to be a piece of paper on top. Prison schedule, this is exactly what I need. Small cupboard, you can store items inside. Contraband, prison rules are very strict. The more dangerous something is, the higher it's in violation. Normal compartments. Wait, contraband? Hmm. Prison rules are very strict. The more dangerous something, the higher it's in. Eh. The cupboard's normal compartments can only store uh, items with violation of two or less. Uh, otherwise, they'll be discovered. Hidden compartments, don't worry. There are hidden places in the cupboard in other corners of the cell where items can be safely stored. Okay. Hmm, so do I understand which, let's see. Organize. Oh, interesting. Basic, advanced. These aren't contraband or else they'd probably tell me them. Hmm. This is, except for the hidden compartments, the cupboard can only store items of vile. I mean, I should be able to store, I'll keep that, I'll put that away. Um. Friendly advice, don't use it to wipe your ass. Uh, I'll just leave, I'll, I'll leave it there, okay. Look at the schedule, though. Uh, morning, head count. All inmates must line up in the lobby on the first floor of the main building on time. 
lateness will be punished. We're gonna have to figure out then where the lobby is. We need a map. I also want to like investigate things. We can use it as a simple workbench. Um, we can write, we can plant. This potted plant seems to be made of plastic. If I want to grow a plant, I guess I'll have to wait for the full version. What can I craft? We got... we can make cloth. We can make lockpicks. Ooh. Oh, wait. Improvised item. With a piece of paper, we can make a... Paper crane. I'm guessing that'll be for, like, for a gift, maybe? Ooh. <laughs> Glass shank. <laughs> Very nice. Digging tool, maybe, too. Okay. Oh, well, let's talk to the donkey. It's only been six minutes. Man, this could be like a... This game feels like it'd be something that'd take a long time. Maybe something I could even stream. That'd maybe be something I could do on my channel if people are really interested. Uh, hi, I'm Thomas, your new cellmate. Yeah, I'm trying to be, uh, I guess, really social. Oh, hi, I was just reading a letter from my girlfriend. I'm Sam, my nickname's Ratchet. I was a mechanic on the outside. <laughs> uh, I don't want to be... Stand out too much. Uh... I work in, I mean, maybe they just know who I am. Uh, I'm a journalist. Hey, no wonder you look familiar. I might have seen your show. Uh, ask how to contact the outside. I need to talk to my lawyer. Of course, this is a modern prison. You can write a letter like me. Uh, or if you're in Harry, there's a payphone in the lobby. You can try after a headcount, but there's usually a line. A phone. That's great news. I'll call after a headcount. The price of justice. Uh, leave this hell and go for the head count. I mean, well, not yet. I want to explore. I should go for a head count. Nah. I don't know if he's forcing the first one. That turtle looks like he's fucking buff. Look at all the animals you can interact with, too. Assuming the red ones are the most dangerous, though. The blue is the, the weakest. Looks like it made it in time. Attention! You can be friends with a turtle, and he'd be like a strong friend to have. Unless he's like a like one of those mean dudes, I don't know. Settle down, all of you, the head count's starting. Uh, one, two, three, that's 44 of seven. Three inmates are absent, two in the fernery, one in segregation, that's all. Listen up, today's the first of the month, which means some uh, more dipshits have joined you. I'll warn you now, do not try to stand out from the crowd. Try to be smart ass in my domain, and I will show you no mercy. Now let's get down to business. All of you newcomers, listen, listen good. To enable you lazy maggots to earn your keep, the present offers work assignments. There's some vacancies in the laundry room. I'm not going to do that for now. So any new inmates who want to earn some money should apply to me. Uh, remember, don't be choosy about your job. If you don't want to do it, someone else will. Eh, I'll take everything. Shut the hell up. I don't have time to listen to your whining. Dismissed. Okay, so I'll, I'll, I'll definitely go for that, yeah. Prison work. I do need some cash. I only have a few coins left in my pocket. The top priority right now is to call Reed. He's probably waiting for him to hear from me. An attent- at attention. What is it? What? You want to work? Good inmates should be kept- keep- should be kept busy. And I have some good news. Right now you can apply to the laundry work without, uh, without good conduct credits. This is a special privilege for new fish like you. If you're interested, uh... Conduct credits. Good conduct credits are one of the warden's innovative policies. You can spend them to apply for prison jobs, self facilities, change of cellmates, and more. There are three ways to earn good conduct credits automatically by not being put in segregation within a day, working hard and completion, completing major prison jobs. The rumor has it that if you can get on good terms with Bruce, you can buy them from him. Bruce, huh? Interesting. Um, so the gears are good, I guess, I. good. Yeah, current good conduct credits, zero. It's a weird icon for good credit, but, okay. Your application your application is approved from now on. You'll be working in the laundry room. It's great job, Fish. You'll love it. So how do I get there? Simple. You see the fence gate. Go out there from before lunch, and a guard will take you to your workplace on the other side of the corridor. Go there from before lunch. But don't try any funny business. The work area is watched by snipers on the tower. You wouldn't want to get your head blown off now, would you? No. Um, guard surveillance. There, there are present guards watching you here. Be smart and don't cause any trouble. Can I get some coffee? A drinking fountain. I never thought there'd be anything like this free in this place. Yeah, I'm sure. My hot water. I thought it was a coffee machine. Uh, you recovered two body. Oh, do I really want to drink, constantly drink? I'm not thirsty. 
Uh, Diego, member of a... Uh, look. Oh, ooh. I can see what he's got on him. I can see if he's a bad dude or not. Anyways. You talking to me? Ah, uh, it costs time. I guess. Costs two. I can only do it a certain amount of times. Billy. Noodle. Sir, I'm a new prisoner, number 1220. Oh, and he smiled. Hey, relax, I'm not a hard ass like Bruce. My name is Billy. I'm the deputy captain I'm responsible for the inmates' day to day lives. Uh, pleased to meet you, sir. According to prison rules, inmates can come to me every week to get their daily essentials, but to be honest, it's never enough, so the inmates usually end up fighting over them. Rest assured, I won't make any trouble. Hey, don't worry. What I mean is, to make life easier for you, I run a small business on the side. For a little money, you can replenish your everyday essentials. Of course, I also sell a few goodies, too. Uh -huh. Sure. Do you need anything? Uh, sure. Oh, free stuff? I mean, yeah. I've already collected the items. Oh, I mean, that makes sure that helps the ship. Uh huh. The money I have is only 50, so I'll see. A Play Pop magazine? Hey! Damn, Game Boy! Let's see, what is this? Oh shit, bedding. Damn, a oh, toothbrush. Um, I mean, I already got a toothbrush. And toothpaste, so I don't I don't need any of this. They gave me a lockpick, so I could literally already make lockpicks, though. So, no, thanks to that, dude, man. How about donkey? It cost. Um, I'll try talking to everyone that doesn't need befriending. Come on, it's been so long. Did you show my script to the director or not? What What do you mean you didn't get a chance? You're his assistant. Do you have any idea how important the script is to me? My entire comeback is riding on it. Seriously, can you get just get it together? Don't forget who helped you when you were at rock bottom. Oh, damn, he looks angry. Maybe we shouldn't mess with him. I tell you, if someone could give me a cold beer right now, I'd even be willing to get, uh, go to Seg for him. Go to Seg? What? Ooh, oh, oh, beer tastes so bland, it cannot hold a candle my excellent wine. Forget beer and wine, the vodka from my hometown will put hair on your chest. Just one sip will blow your mind. I have a small bottle stashed away, I'll give you a taste sometime. Awesome, buddy. I had some in the bar up north one time. That's the stuff so strong, it'll go up with just one spark. I hear some guy use it to make Molotov cocktails. Whispering, hey, keep your voice down, man. You want Bruce to hear you? Ah, I'm not gonna rat on them. No, no, no. I'm sure you could rat on them, probably. Wait, what? What did he say? It's always great to what from afar? Ooh, wine gourd. He's definitely strong, though. Iceberg is roaring. Talking to himself, or... Eh, it looks like I'd have to befriend them all. Anyways, uh, I gotta find a map, so give me one second. I gotta find out where I'm going for, like, the laundry stuff. Okay, so lunchtime is behind those doors. I wonder if there's a way I could... Wait, maybe a tutorial? Oh, no. Like, look at all this. Oh, there's so much to think about. Um, maybe, like, what is this? Prison schedule. Yeah, you'll... Lunch. I mean, getting here at lunch... Time spent in the cafeteria may not exceed one hour. Uh, recreation. Are forbidden to return to the main building without doing recreation. Like, me doing the workouts can happen there. I don't have to, like, squeeze random time doing, uh, like, workouts at random times, so... The only thing I question is, it means I can a enter other people's houses, maybe, and, like... I can find people's names, but I can't steal from them. I don't know if I should... Boss. I don't want to deal with these people. I should make friends, though, for sure. Personal. You need reputation 50. Gang. The sharp tooth gangs control the population's basketball court and TV room. He's the boss. Alex the Lion. You want something from the sharp tooth? Uh... You want to do a job, is what I like to hear. I just happen to have a few jobs right now, sort of like you, but listen... Good. I hate to f I hate to fail, so if you take a job, you better not mess up. Uh, no, 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 not yet. What's up, Bear? I'm gonna see what's going on here, I guess. Trouble! Asking Raphael to negotiate with Bigfoot Gang was nothing but a waste of time. Those bastards wanted the kitchen all to themselves right from the start. Um... Set fire. Uh, calm down, it's not time to go to war with them yet. And don't forget the sharp tooth Gang, Alex isn't stupid. Uh... Oh. We 
are you looking at? Wait. You need at least 30 reputation to befriend the gang lieutenant. Okay. Personal. So he's a boss as well? Wait. Gang of a crown gang. So it's two different gangs. The sharp tooth or whatever, and this is different. Black claw gang. Alright. I'd assume maybe what I should do is try to, like, befriend all the big people. Oh, wait, there's an up, up, up area. Is this where I'd work out? Corleone family? <laughs> what is this? Entertainment section. Read the sign. TV room. Read the high sign. Opens at 20 every day. Movies on Mondays, Thursday, basket. Nah. Examine the lock. I don't see a keyhole. I was going to see I could pick these locks, but there's cameras watching me, so I have to figure out if there's a way cameras can't watch me in, in certain areas or something else. The door is locked. I think if I go back down here, I'd go back to the very start, maybe? Yeah. I'd want to maybe, like, befriend guys named Bill and just overall make friends with, like, the right and the strongest people to help defend me. I also want to know what's over here. Oh, yeah. So 20, I can come here for the entertainment section, I guess, is what they're saying. Because if it says it's open every day at 20, that means bathroom's open to save water, time spent in the bathroom. So at 1800, you can go to the bathrooms just to relieve everything before going to bed. And at 20, go to the entertainment maybe for stat bonuses and things you can get up here. But at 22, all inmates must return to the cell. I, like Basically, like, go home at like 21.30, if not, you know, 15 minutes before, because time does go quite damn slow. It's only 9 p.m. I've already been playing for 36 minutes. What's it going on here? The wheels of fate have started to turn. This time of judgment is at hand. Hiss, I must find better offerings. The stars in the ocean will be pleased. Okay, this is like the religious gang, I guess, maybe. And no gang affiliation, weirdly. I'm just gonna leave him alone. I'm gonna let's try to befriend this guy. Hi. Uh, hi, what do you mean, hi? You looking for trouble? I'm just saying hi, what's the problem with that? What's the problem? It's a big problem, you know here. That ain't how things work in the big house. Hey, hi, hello, yo, they all have their own meanings. Unless you want a beaten, you better figure out what open the mouth. Uh, I just don't get it. What's the difference? No, I don't want to piss him off. Uh-oh. I'll give you one last chance. Use the wrong word and I'll have no choice. I... You've befriended Bill the Buffalo. His report will help you. A hot-tempered buffalo, his curved horns and flared nostrils all say, Don't mess with me. He seems to have spent many years inside, and the way he speaks and interacts with other inmates follows a very strict set of unwritten rules. You need to be careful when talking to him, as you never know when you might step into a minefield. I, I kind of get him. We'll see. Uh, Trade. So he wants food, alcohol. He wants nails. He'll buy, I guess, nails from me for a dollar, I guess. Yeah. Or I buy that from him. It says buy. Okay. Tutorial gift, 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 gifting. You can raise report by giving gifts, but of course, everyone in here likes different things. Note, to avoid making gifts look cheap, you can only give one gift to each per Okay. If I examine him, then. Gang, Bigfoot member. I don't know what the money times four means. I'm not sure what he likes them. What would he like? I, I guess it tells me what he hates and wants and doesn't like. I don't want to give anything away at the moment then. I'll just... I befriended them and used some of my tokens. Um, being that I will be... Bef like, I'll be, I'll be talking to the donkey a lot, so I might as well befriend him too while on my way. Or I guess I can't for now.
Ah, shit. All right, let's see this. I can re-roll tutorial challenge actions. Some actions require you to have sufficient ability. During a challenge, you'll roll two six-sided uh, two six-sided dice and then compare the dice you rolled with the target points. If the number of the dice, okay, so it's D and D logic, I guess. If the number of dice is not uh, rolling two sixes is a direct success, and double ones is a direct failure. Of snake eyes. If you fail a challenge, you still have an opportunity to redeem yourself by spending one focus to reroll the dice. Re re uh, to re-roll the dice, you only get one. Reroll after each failure. Oh, you're kidding me. I can't find the problem. I guess I'll have to put up with... Uh, that cost me like an hour, I think. What did that do to my... Uh, investigate. 42% chance costs energy. Um, 30 minutes and 15 energy? I really... What other things can I be doing right now? L leaky toilet. The toilet in your cell is leaking. Reward 20 mine, though. Find the cause. Ugh. Maybe if I just... Like, the guy would probably get pissed off if I did, but... Maybe I'll try one more. Oh, thank God. I think I found a cause. Uh, oh, jeez. The screws, the toilet loose, so the water pipe... Nah, nah. Okay. Since the screws are loose, it might be possible to remove the entire toilet. Then I can go through the hole and go to the pipe area behind the wall. There should be a passageway all over the inside. No guards patrolling. This should be a good starting point if I want to get out of the boat. Prepare to disassemble. Think about the tools. I need assembly tools. Uh, look at the notch on the top. Maybe we can use a coin. It would be too much more efficient. It would be much more efficient if I could craft some suitable tools. How much time? There are probably people coming and going the corridor all day long. I'd almost certainly be discovered. Yeah, I guess after lockdown would be the best time to do it. And only when my cellmate is asleep. Fool the guards. Once it's disassembled, there's still a problem. The guards patrolling at night, although they just go through the motions. But it'll be too obvious that there's not any, even anyone in bed. I Just to be on the safe side, I should use a pillow to make a dummy. Doesn't look like it's going to be an easy task. I'd better, I'd better settle in for a long haul. Remove the toilet and go to the pipe area. I can't do it now, so, yeah. You could mess up already then. Like, I can't even save it. Every, everything has consequences. You do have to remember that. Let's see then. This is not contraband, right? Points plus two when disassembling. Hmm. The terms are simple. Starting from today, if the Black Claw Gang wants to carry moving product through the kitchen, the fee goes up to 50%. Come on, Frank, this is against the code. The fee was set when the territories were f first agreed. Oh, you can't change it now. Hey, there's a reason for the increase. The truck driver who delivers ingredients, old Ben, as you know, he's retired. Now his son's taken over the job. The kid's a pain in the ass. He wants double every, th every month. Surely you can't expect the Bigfoot Gang to foot the whole bill. Hmm. Hey, now, this sounds like a problem you should be taking care of. How, and how do I even know you're not just making the whole thing up? I don't care if you believe me or not, the increase is non-negotiable. You tell Caesar that if he ain't willing to pay, then he can't f can find a new, pro a new way to move his product. Fine, I'll give him the message. Just wait for his answer. Drama. Hey, old, big elephant. I should definitely... Oh, he's a boss. I don't want to mess with a fucking elephant. Wait, how much to be friends? Same thing? Yeah. Walrus, even. He's a member. Wait, what do you say there's no peace and quiet? Oh wait, wisdom experience plus five. Wonder if that did me any good. Let's see, wisdom experience plus fifty, wisdom experience plus five. Skills, wisdom, A. Hey. Okay, that helps. Compared to the great wisdom of strategizing, bond with one prisoners. Oh, uh, activation. Okay. Bond with one prisoner with this skill. Jail smarts. Hmm, purchase 20 items with other prisoners. Interesting. Well, I mean, I can bond uh, naturally over time, whatever. I don't know if there's anywhere else I can go here, though. Just talk to these people. I mean, maybe I should try to join with John. John, I mean, is a big fucking cat. I mean, he's a tiger. He's not exactly the prettiest looking one. Is he a tiger? My legs suddenly feel weak. I'm new here. Can you hear me? Oh my god, I saw you here by yourself. You don't seem to have any friends. So I thought, oh my god, why are you saying such stupid things, you dumb? Yes, then you can go. He's even scarier than he looks. 
A loner of few words, with his personality that makes him extremely unapproachable. He has a reputation of a, as a terrifying fighter, to the extent that even the three gangs do not dare mess with him. His only hobby is smoking alone during recreation. A lone wolf like him almost certainly has an interesting pass. Okay, so he likes smoking. I can gift him cigarettes. If I ever get them. Okay. So I know the kind of things people like, and basically if I want to get on people's good sides, I'll want to know what they like. Like, the, pay, the boar in Middle City likes beer. So you just have to, like, write down what they like, or focus, I guess, on a wiki of which would have it. So, I mean, it's the demo. I won't write down what people like, like at Stardew Valley, and become obsessive with learning every single thing every single inmate loves. That's for when the full game comes out. Wait, the hands... Wait, wait. He hit, hey there, little fella. You oh, no. Up for something naughty. Oh, no, you misunderstand, Mr. Horse. I wasn't staring. You see, now you just made two big mistakes in one tiny little sense. You're, if you're not careful, I might have to punish you. Oh, no. First, you see my horn? I'm a, clearly a unicorn. Unicorn? Second, don't call me Mr. Gender labels can find me. As a unicorn, I should be free and unrestrained. So I should call you Free Unicorn? Just call me by my name, Ray. That's much more intimate. You befriended Ray with the Ray hor uh, race horse. I... A brown horse who claims to be a unicorn, he may look slightly odd, but his artistic flamboyance is never dull. He rejects gender labels and has a unique view of the relationship between gender and self, however, he makes no secret of his love for handsome guys. Oh no. I'll just, uh, leave him alone. It's like 3D too, so I can go, and even here when it looks like it's 2D, there is depth. But now that it's going close to lunch, I think that'll be one of the last things I do. Just to maybe see what happens. I'm not even sure when the game saves even, man. At least I can pause it and then continue playing another episode after. Wait, I shouldn't have done that. Let's just get ready for lunch. What I probably actually should have done, if the focus points is how I can make friends, um, then me not making friends at the instant I started playing is probably a big mistake. So it's like you make friends, make it go to zero, and then like continue doing your job, basically, or your tasks. I can't make a picklock because I need nails, though. Oh, looks like the phone's free. Shit. How much does it cost? Uh, how much does it cost? You can make two more calls today. Uh, oh, a 90, I, I, yeah. Another quest. So let's see, I need to give a lawyer a call, but I need money. I need nails, um, remove the toilet and the pipe area. That's, that's after. How about the relationships and all that stuff that was on there? Oh, maybe things, okay. When sitting next to him at lunch, there's a chance he'll share his food with you. Oh. All oh, things you can do. What? That's cool. They actually have things you can look out for to try to do. You can buy the basic items. Okay. You can buy the intermediate items. Once you get to oh, once you get to twenty report. I see. Do I know though what he's into? Like, hmm. There's no. I guess like, at least it tells you who's part of what gang. That's good to know, too. I want to become allies with people not part of gangs, 100%. Ooh. Who is it? Ferret Maggie. I don't care about the poodle, but named Beth. <laughs> Pig cook bricks. I gotta find out who this little ferret is. Advertising agency. Graphic design. Oh, I thought they were a prison nurse, man. That would be nice. Ferret nurse. Hmm. But anyways... I'll wait for lunchtime, and also for this to restore. Wait, a health certificate? Wait, what? You have to go to the infirmary for a physical... Uh, I guess I have to go to the infirmary. Where the fuck's the infirmary? Okay, go to the infirmary. According to regulations, all new inmates must go to the infirmary for a physical. How long does it take? I don't want to miss lunch. I'll wait. I might have to just end the episode here, though, to be f completely frank. I could play this a lot. I could see it do going well with a stream. I'm going to just check my uh, prison cell to check for the schedule. I guess I might as well buy the nails from this guy. Then I can make the lockpick and complete the quest. 
It's probably exactly what they intended, but it's not like you'd know exactly the friend the buffalo, but now we can make a lockpick. We can lockpick something, but it'll probably be contraband, so we'll need to put it in our little hidden compartment. Or else you mess up, you know? Uh, yeah. Ah, uh, it costs 30 minutes. No, no, we need lunch. Uh, I guess I'll do that after lunch. So anyways, let's leave it here. I hope you enjoyed and look forward to the next episode. That just took a lot of time, but the game is definitely something I'd maybe definitely stream uh, when it releases. Though I'm not sure when it releases. Let me double check. Uh, it says 2023, so it won't be for a while, but in terms of the demo, depending on how long the demo is, maybe I could play like the next 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 episode on stream it depends on how much i can do when the game decides to stop you know like when it just says hey end of demo maybe going for lunch equals end of demo or at least one whole day or a few whole days don't know but we'll find out i hope you enjoyed look forward to the next episode and if you did enjoy please leave a like comment hit that subscribe button make more fluff scarver and hit the notification down below for updates on my videos thank you for watching until next time <laughs>